Hey guys, welcome to my channel. I'm Jess and I'm going to be making videos on natural living, how to be more sustainable and eco-friendly and travel related content. Today I'm going to be giving you 10 eco-friendly products that are great for travel and vacation. The first product I have are soap and shampoo bars. Shampoo and shower gel are not only bulky and heavy, they also almost always come in plastic bottles. These are a great eco-friendly alternative, they smell amazing and they last ages. These ones I have here are all natural ingredients so they don't have any of the nasty chemicals in This is my travel towel, it's 100% cotton so it's way way better than the standard microfiber towels that you can get. It's super absorbent, it dries really quickly and it feels so much softer on your skin. This one I got on Amazon, it's huge and it folds down really small as well. So it's great to put in a little backpack. If you're going somewhere hot you'll probably want some sun cream. Standard sun cream you can get is full of nasty chemicals, which aren't great for our bodies. So this one is 100% natural, it's from Green People, it has an SPF of 30, it's water resistant and it's non-greasy. Perfect. Next on the list is my bamboo toothbrush. Plastic toothbrushes never biodegrade. All the plastic toothbrushes you've ever owned has either ended up in the landfill or the ocean, which is kind of sad. Um, these ones biodegrade within a couple of years, so you can just put them in your compost or food bin or whatever. This one I got at a vegan fair and it comes with its own little box, so when I'm travelling it keeps it nice and fresh and clean. Next on the list is my safety razor. Same with toothbrushes, plastic razors never biodegrade. So this one is made from stainless steel, it's completely reusable and you just replace the blades every few months or whenever you need to and it keeps it nice and sharp. This one is actually a man's razor, uh, you can get female versions if you want to, um, I don't think there's any difference apart from the female ones they just make them pink. <laughs> Next I want to talk about clothing. I tend to buy most of my clothing secondhand. You can get some amazing secondhand shops around the world. Um, personally, when we were in New Zealand, um, stuff was super cheap and you can get some real gems, it was amazing. The trousers I'm wearing are made from bamboo. Uh, they are the softest things I've ever worn and I just love them and they're amazing for travel as well. The bikini I've bought is actually from ASOS but they make it from recycled fishing nets. Swimwear is usually made from a stretchy kind of plasticky material, so I think it's amazing that they can reuse their stuff like fishing nets and take them out of the sea. Walking socks! <laughs> Me and my partner Francis, we love to climb mountains, so we need a good pair of socks when we're doing that. These are hand knitted by my parents' neighbour. They're wool, so they're super cosy, and they're amazing quality, so they'll last this really long time. Next up is tote bags or canvas bags. When you're travelling especially, it's super useful to have a couple of extra bags if you're shopping or if you pick up anything along the way. This one is 100% cotton, so it's way better for the environment than the plasticky nylon ones that you get for travel. I also have a couple of produce bags that I use to put all my loose fruit and veg in so I can avoid plastic in supermarkets and markets. Also it could be useful for any extra clothes or anything else you need a spare bag for. So when I'm staying in hostels and things like that, I find it useful to have a couple of extra containers with me and some beeswax wraps. <laughs> a bit of a mouthful. Um, beeswax wraps. This is a pretty standard plastic box. Um, the company is Systema and they make really good quality stuff and the plastic is also BPA free. If you don't know what BPA is, it's basically a nasty chemical that's found in most plastics. If you are buying things like plastic boxes and plastic bottles, I'd recommend that you find them BPA free. These are one of my favourite products. They're basically food wraps, so replacement for things like cling film and foil. They're cloth, covered in a beeswax coating, 
so they keep food nice and fresh and they're compostable at the end of their life. They last about a year. Uh, these ones I got from Beeswax Wraps UK, but you can get them in other places. I believe Abigo do some as well. Last but very much not least, these are some of the most important things that I carry with me everywhere. One of the most essential things to take travelling with you, or take anywhere with you really, is to have a good quality water bottle. This one is stainless steel so it keeps the water a bit cooler in the summer and it avoids me buying plastic bottles. This is one of those things that's not really that essential but if you're a crazy tea fanatic like I am, uh, you'll want one. <laughs> I carry this with me everywhere and it also comes in useful when I need an extra flask for water or something like that. This is my little pouch of cutlery and utensils. It's potentially my favourite thing that I take with me travelling. Inside here I have a fork and spoon made from bamboo. I also have a couple of bamboo straws and I also have a tiny little spork. One of the biggest problems facing our oceans at the moment is single-use plastic, things like plastic cutlery and plastic straws. These microplastics can also enter our body through our drinking water or by eating fish. Not good. This is where you can make a huge difference. Carrying something as small as this means that I can avoid hundreds of pieces of plastic every year. Thank you guys for watching. If you're interested in any of the products, I've listed them all in the description below. If you're interested in natural living or sustainable travel or anything like that, please subscribe to my YouTube channel and follow me on Instagram. My link is here. I will catch you soon.